So here's the video I said I was going to make. These are the pictures I just uploaded from my camera. I want to scroll down here, find the ones that I that I chose to to do, which this is one of them. I adjust this. I right click on it, open with paint. It's going to be really big. If you go all the way up here to the top of the screen, you'll see image. Hit image, go to resize slash skew, whatever skew means, and then in the box here it says 100, backspace that out. I usually do 50, then 50. Okay, it shrinks it. I go back to image, resize again, 50, 50. And basically I'm doing the same thing over and over again until I get the, the size of the picture I want to where it'll all fit to where I can get two pictures fit on one thing. There's one. So now I'll go and save this f picture. Actually I don't even have to save it yet so don't don't save it. Take your screen and draw it big again. That way you get your white in the background like this. Now I minimize this. See the one finger right here? I'll minimize this. Close that one out. I don't need it anymore. Now I'll go to this picture. Two fingers. Open with paint. Same thing I did with the other one. Resize and skew. And I do usually do it three times. It's about the perfect size for the side-by-side -side images. Now, I take this picture and I go to image. Nope, sorry. See this little box up here? Click on that. Go to the bottom of your picture. Engulf the whole picture with that box. Right click inside of it. Copy. I'll minimize that. I can close this out. Now I go to the bottom where I have the other one already done with the number one. I go back up to this little ch checkered box, click on it, go out here, right click and paste. Boom. Two. Instantly. Slide her right over beside it. Now you want to get fancy and put things underneath it. You've got these boxes over here that you can use. Take the box, put it over here. And for example, I'll toss this in there. Oh, my bad. Oops, hold on. Because you could do it anywhere you want to on the screen, so I'll do it here. So let me change it to about 22. I'll just use one team, go to the checkered box, go over one team, drag and drop that underneath this, start on a, the next picture, what I want to put underneath it, I'll just put a box. You can add fancy colors and whatnot. My wife does that all the time. She's always putting fancy pictures on it. I'll go back up to the letter A to where I can type, and I'll put one mission. <coughs> then I can take the box, the checkered box again, go around it, put it anywhere I want to. Go up to file, save as, you'll bring it up, you get a title anything you want. I will title this one team, one mission, save. I can close all this out. Not my Facebook. Add photo, upload photo, browse, go to actually I think you might be able to search down here. One 
whatever you titled it as, not in that folder. Uh, pictures. Go to the date of the picture you did it, which today I think it's a little off. No, it's 627, and it'll be in here. Here it is. Here is the photo I did and paint. We'll share video directly after this. Wow, I spelled everything right. Forgot to capitalize that though. So basically I hit post and a few seconds later, wham, there it is. One team, one mission. You see the one in this one, the two in this one. It's fairly simple and I made the video that way if anyone has any questions or any, any concerns on how to do it, they can just continuously play the video over and over and over and over until they get it. But I'm going to go ahead and take this off here. That way I don't have to be on there. And then I'll share the video and hope you all enjoy it and I hope it helps everybody out.